Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Factorio. Alright, today, what are we going to do? So I was working on my mall more, and I think I got to the point where I needed stone and stone bricks. Because we were going to do furnaces, and electric furnaces, and we can also do oil refineries. And we need to do chemical plants. Um, but I think what I need to do before we go any further, just for kind of my own sanity, is to further remove some of this stuff up here so that we can extend the, the bus a bit further and also figure out what we're going to do with um, gear wheels here. So I had mentioned previously in a few episodes ago that maybe we could take the whole mall and just scoot it down a little bit and then have our iron gear wheels crafted over here and then shove the, uh, feed them over here to the mall that would probably be here in this city block if we're still doing city blocks. Um, I guess this forest is going to have to go. Unfortunately. So, that means we're going to have to deal with all this fluid as well. We've got solid fuel here. Let's um, cut that off. And I could at least... Um, I didn't do this with the um, lubricant when I was watching and editing one of my previous videos. There was still some, or no, wait, it was it wasn't lubricant? It was uh, plastic, I think. Um, I left some uh, some liquids in the machines, and I didn't actually let them craft it. So let's not do that for this. Let's actually use up all the petroleum that's in the system here. So that it doesn't go to waste. And then, yeah, we're going to have to figure out where to pump this stuff. I have a lot of light oil over here, too. Yeah, we're going to have to do something with that for sure. I don't want to lose all of that. That's a lot. How much is this? Yeah, 231k. That's quite a lot. Um, these artillery shells are continuing to be a pain to deal with. These have no power. Oh, but they're all full. I guess I severed powered over to here, huh? Okay, let's just bring this up here. Like that. And I guess we'll just do another row of these things. Or that many anyway. Apparently I'm out of chests. Yeah, I kind of want to get rid of this whole belt of artillery shells for now. Okay, it looks like all the petroleum is used up now. So now we just have to get all this solid fuel off of the line here. That's good. We're starting to get attacked from all sides now by the biters. Alright, so this can all go now. And I don't know what I'm going to do with the solid fuel. Okay, we'll bring this down a bit more. Oh, 
Man, still need a lot of chests for artillery shells. Did I make a chest for chests in here somewhere? Yes, I did. Just grab a hundred. Oh, I didn't put any there in the first place because of power, I guess. Okay, what's that going to do for us? Looks like we're getting close to emptying it out finally. a lot of artillery shells <sighs> probably not a lot in the grand scheme of things but anyway um, how is this getting power actually this isn't going anywhere oh it's going up there sometimes these cables are really hard to see Okay, so yeah, it's getting... A, I, I just did that. I don't know why I forgot already. <laughs> anyway. Uh, okay. Um, so this sulfur line can go now. And we don't have to worry about losing water. That is not big deal um actually i probably should have done the same thing here that i did in the other spot for uh crafting or just using up the rest of the stuff that's in here the oil so we're full on heavy oil, is that what the problem is right now? And that's because the lubricant has nowhere to go. Okay, so let's... Fix that. I guess it's automatically going to come up here, isn't it? Because it has nowhere else to go. Uh, let's go around. Alright, so there's no new oil coming to this mach these machines, so it's just going to use up whatever is left in here. Yeah, perfect. That's what I wanted to see. Yep, okay. So now they can be deconstructed. Oh, let's wait until these are done to cut power. should just be using up whatever's left in the system here. Yeah, now they should turn off, which they did. Um, now I guess I need a pump because there's still some in these pipes. Okay. Just 
still icons on some of these. Is that just indicating that that's what it's supposed to be? And it doesn't actually have any in there. Yeah, it says on the right, lubricant 0, 100. So yeah, we're good. All right, cool. So now all of this can go. Okay, I'm going to save this just uh, in case I want to use it at some point. Um, let's see. Yeah, we're going to have to get rid of all of these machines too. Over here, we're making batteries. And this is not using any liquids, but it does have sulfuric acid in it. So I guess what we should do here then is cut off the supply of ingredients. And this is full, I'm presuming. Yeah. And then we'll just... Craft the rest of these. To use up the rest of this sulfuric acid. Um, let's do that. Make this a little faster. guessing it probably won't take very long to use all this stuff up. Yeah, it's going relatively quickly. Okay, and then this was our basic oil processing, which we don't really want to use, but I may as well not waste the oil that's in here. Um, I already cut the oil off. So I guess we just need to grab this sulfur off the line here and it'll craft the rest. Yeah. Okay, yeah, those should be empty now. some in there. Alright, let's go empty our inventory a little bit. mostly sulfur it looks like and yeah I do have a uh, auto trash for that there we go this is gonna be a pain to deal with okay are these all done now Looks like we have a little petroleum gas left in these. Like, not a bunch. 150-ish, looks like. Yeah, I'm not gonna fuss over that much. So we'll get rid of these now. And then 
this water is not going anywhere now. So those can all go. So can this. And now these, are they done? They use up all the sulfuric acid. Yep. All right, cool. So these can all go. chests all full. I guess we didn't actually make chests for everything yet. Um, so let's do... What did I do after assemblers? The train stops... signals and then chain signals so train stops train signals chain signals then storage tanks I also want to redesign this a little bit. I started doing it down here with the concrete. I need to make more concrete for that though. But it's kind of in the way right here. So I need to figure out what we're going to do to deal about to deal with that other than just having the items over here, I suppose. Um all right. So these belts, or this belt insanity, I should say, is for our new mall, which, you know, this was all supposed to be temporary, so I need to fix all that. Um, let's see what else we can clean up here. So let's get rid of this and this. Where's that coal going? It's going down the whole thing. Okay. again.
probably gonna run out of space over here soon. Looks like there's one chest that's still totally empty. Alright. So we're getting close. Um, I guess let me just do these by hand. Can't do those yet. Huh, there's still iron here. Okay, well that's going to take too long. That's funny though, I should mine that up. Um, okay, one more time, let's go get rid of all these batteries. take this coal, or uh, I mean oil. Um, I don't, I don't really want to have it anywhere in this area because I want to continue the main bus all along this way. So I wonder if I should put them like up here, maybe. Or I could just take them way over here. I actually never set up tanks for strictly oil over here. Huh. Oh, yes, I did up here. Okay. Well, then, yeah, maybe we should just run them over to here. So if I wanted to do that... I'd have to kind of plow through up here. Well, I could go on my liquid bus line that I made. That would, I suppose, be the smart thing to do. So let's do that then. Uh, so we're going to get a pump. And I need to figure out where this line's going to be. So let's go uh, copy this. with all these robo ports. Also, should I be using pumps along this line? Maybe. I don't really know. All 
right. Um, thing. You have no power. All right. Why is that going up instead of down? What in the world? Was it just equalizing? So yeah, I'm wondering if now is the time where I, I need pumps all along this line to push it this direction. It's very possible. Um, I need to run it the rest of the way to the other oil tanks though. So let's do that. You know, I should really... I should have done this a little more smart. I should have removed these power poles and done these pipes at the maximum distance they could go and then work the power poles around that limitation. Same thing with these belts. These should be undergrounds. that uh, this one too okay sure where I want to take it. I don't know if I want to come down here or over here and then down. I guess we can just go straight across. So I could have done this the whole time. I don't know why I didn't. It's a lot easier to play something like this. Okay, so now in theory, um, I guess let's put another pump here. Into here. And then it'll meet up here like that and then we need to run power all the way out here um, guess we'll just do it like this and so then in theory these should fill up quite a bit more. And in fact, we might even have to add more tanks. Yeah, looks like it is increasing. Yes, it is. Good. Um, how many tanks did I have over here? Six? Yeah. 
Are these going down? Yes, they are. Perfect. These are all less than half full, so we might need three new tanks. And I just put them all away, all the way back on the other side of the base. Uh, of course I did. All right, let's go grab them. What are you guys doing? Oh, you're taking trash out. Okay. Yeah, our plastic production is not so great at the moment. Also, let's make sure we keep the power going here. Yeah, we're going to have to figure out the power a little bit better on this line right here. What are you doing? You're giving me red undergrounds. Cool. Uh, those should be down here. I guess we can have 15. Let's add three more. There we go. Wow, those e those filled up fast. I was gonna say they equalized fast. I guess that is technically what it's doing. Uh, what are we looking like down here now? Almost empty. Thinking of uh, Star Wars as I watch this number counting down. Almost there. It's away. <laughs> so yeah, I'm presuming when these all get to zero, what I'm hoping to see is all these icons disappear. I'm not sure why that happens. I guess because it's like marked as this was oil, so it keeps the icon, even though it is empty. But yeah, it looks like the icons disappeared out of the pipes, at least some of them. Yeah, this says zero now. Zero. There's very little. And actually, yeah, it's still draining. So I think we're good. I think we got all the oil moved now. So let's head back. And I think by the time we get back there, it'll be uh, empty. Okay, well that icon disappeared. Yeah, and these are just because they're fractions of a number, I guess. Or is it still going down? 0 0.2, 0 0.5, 0 0.7. Yeah, I'm not going to fret over that. Cool, okay. Um, so if we put one more pump, like here, I 
Yeah, there we go. All right, cool. We shall call that good. There we go. All right, so now I think all we have to deal with is uh, these insane number of chests. Oh, and the lubricant. Uh, should I do the same thing for the lubricant? I have tanks for lubricant over here, right? Yes, I do. Um, yeah, I suppose. One of the things, though, that I'm wondering is there's five liquids, right? oil, petroleum gas, light oil, heavy oil, and lubricant. I guess there's also sulfuric acid, but we only have space for four here is what I was getting at. So, um, <laughs> I guess maybe I'll run it, but it won't be permanent because I don't know what I want on the bus here. I don't really think I need lubricant on the bus, do I? Because it's only used for engines. I think that's the only thing. These. Maybe there's other stuff. I don't know. But yeah, I guess let's go ahead and do that. We'll run it on the second line here. Okay, we got to do the same thing again with this underground. And I guess we'll do a pump here. Um, where is it? Okay, it's down here. Let's do another pump here. Then we'll come down this way. Boy, they really like that corner. Uh, actually, we'll leave that there and we'll just do another one like that. And then we gotta get power. Nope, not substations. Let's just use these. Go from here, I suppose. Okay. So, we need to get power here as well. That's not going to work, is it? There we go. Alright, so now it should pump that down this direction. This isn't good. We've got water going right here. So I can't tap into this tank. Um, I guess we're gonna have to move this over, unfortunately. to have undergrounds for the water here. Well, 
okay, so this can get moved over to like here, I guess. And then we can run it over from here. Like that. This is going to be tricky though. Can I get this out of here? I can't, I mean, I can do an underground here, but if I put an underground here, well, I'd have to do two undergrounds and then bring it up further up here. Okay. Well, that's not great. And I have no more pumps. Why didn't I think of that? I should have grabbed another one. Okay, let's go get one. Actually, do I have stuff to make one? No, probably not because of my trash slots. Did I put them in a chest yet? No, it doesn't look like I did. Or wait, did I even make them? Yes, but we have no, what, iron? Oh no. This isn't going to work. Oh, I didn't even think about this. It's prioritizing or it's filtering the iron to only go this way. Or I mean the steel. Oh no, our design is not going to work like that. Huh. Well, I guess it's not the end of the world if there's a little bit of extra red circuits on this belt that never get used, but it's certainly not ideal. Hmm. Okay. I guess we'll just do that for now. Copy paste filters. Oh, it's reminding me. Yeah, that's right. I do remember that. Yeah, so copy paste just removes it. Yep. All right. I never set an output for this either. Oh. You guys don't have uh, inserters. That's why you're not doing anything. Um, so you need just iron, which is on the far belt. Oh, and you have no power. Right. Oh, and you still have no power. All right, well, we're gonna have to do this then. working now. Okay. Two of them. 
should be good enough for what I need right now. We're down to just a trickle of plastic. Okay, so pump will go here, and of course it's one away from power. That's silly, but whatever. That is filling up. What are we looking like over here? Uh, yeah, looks like it got it all. Okay, cool. Why is this so low? It's barely getting any petroleum. That's because we're out of petroleum. Okay. So I guess petroleum really is the, the bottleneck. So that's why you have to do cracking. And this is the only recipe, light oil cracking to petroleum gas. It's either advanced oil processing or this. So yeah, we're gonna have to set that up then to do plastic in larger quantities. Okay, that will be for another time. So now we can get rid of this. Cool. Okay. So now it's just this insanity here. So if I just say deconstruct. I guess we're gonna have to go place a bunch more storage chests. So let's place them. We're kind of running out of space up here. I guess we're just gonna shove them wherever we can. here. Well, maybe not. They're going pretty fast. Oh, but all these guys are trying to charge up from my suit. I could uh, empty out a bunch of my inventory. That'll help some. Oh, 
Oh, <laughs> it's trying to give me back some items that I have requested. Should help a little bit. Yep. It's going to take several trips. trying to give me stuff back. Let's put this on zero. Trying to give me radars. Where are you guys going? With the stone. Where are they going? They're going way over here for storage chests? Is that because there's already stone over there? Even though there's space up here, that must be it. They try to stack it with where there already is some. Interesting. Well, that's going to take a lot longer to empty out my inventory, guys. All right, let's just help them along here. Let's just put this at zero for now. This too. Come on, guys. Oh, look at that. They're actually taking it from this chest and putting it over here. That's interesting. So they really do try to stack it up. That's, that's good, actually. I like that. forever. I wish I had just done this in the first place. I don't know why I put him there. Because it was a problem for future me, that's why. And now future me is yelling it past me. And now I have no logistic bots because they're all down here now. Is that what's going on? They're all charging up over here. I wonder if we can take these out of here. Yeah, I didn't realize that uh, this was a mechanic. No, they're still trying to put it in there. This RoboPort doesn't even have power, interestingly. But yeah, if we have these all over the base, that could potentially cause an issue. I don't know.
I guess it could also be that those chests weren't in the logistic network, but they've got to be, right? Let's go check. Okay, no, they're actually using them now. Yes, they're in the logistic network. And they are putting stuff in there now. I wonder if I can make a bunch more logistic bots to help out. Um, let me... Well, after they empty these trash slots... Okay, let's turn this off. And I'll grab all of those. And then robot frames. I know I had a bunch. Oh. No, I turned it off. I thought that these bots were coming to take them, but no. All right, so let's make those. space to put those logistic bots. Alright, so yeah, we're gonna need to put this up to Um, shoot, well, 600, I guess. And robot frames, 200, and then turn this back on. Stack, put those in there. Boy, they just immediately fly out of there and go into service, don't they? crafting. Let's go make another haul. I'm out of suit batteries again. They weren't taking stuff all the way down there. And we're using these instead. Okay. 
What a mess. Of course, that's kind of been the story of our base for the last several episodes, hasn't it? Just making a mess. Alright, let's help it help them along again. still have oh they brought me more robot frames I was wondering why I had so many more um, well I guess we could craft some more sure suit have any spots free? No, it doesn't. I wonder if I should take these out and put more solar panels in. I don't know. Almost. Okay, we're almost done crafting those bots. There we go. Okay, let's do another load. for deconstruction right now. I'm not sure I want to do this after all. It might cause more headaches than I want to deal with. Might be better to just have one spot where everything gets dumped from my trash slots. I don't know.
Wow, we're over an hour again. I said several episodes ago that I thought, oh, 45 minutes seems like a good length, and then the last several have all been over an hour. I hope you guys don't mind. But if, if you're new to my channel, or if you recall me saying in the past, kind of my whole point with my channel here was mostly just for me to, number one, have fun, and number two, um, not do a bunch of editing. I kind of wanted to have everything I do in game shown in a video, which unfortunately means sometimes you get a video like this where it's a lot of you know, standing around waiting for my suit to charge and waiting for trash slots to get emptied and doing menial tasks like moving 50 chests of <laughs> copper and stone from one spot to another. So, I guess some people watch on 1.5 speed or 2x speed. I can't do that. I've tried to do that before, but it does not work for me. So, I watch regular speed, but. If you can watch faster and still, you know, absorb any uh, information or entertainment from the videos, then more power to you. My hat goes off to you. Alright, well our bots are just going to kind of be mopey and follow us around for a bit. But I've got no suit power, so they can't charge at the moment. So we're going to have to do a lot of this manually. fast. They're still flying down here. Why? Oh, because they're still deconstructing. Okay. Still at zero percent. Yeah, I guess I'm not even running fast either since my suit power is out. That's uh, something I hadn't even considered. Your exoskeleton legs don't work either when your suit battery is drained. We're not going to have enough chests here. Let's uh, get rid of these regular ones. More. Oh wait, that's a regular one too, huh? Alright, let's just load it up with chests everywhere over here. This will be a fun future me problem as well. Oh, I have uh, chemical plants set to 10. That's why I kept giving those back to me. Okay, let's go grab some more.
Wow, those get emptied pretty fast when you got a lot of logistic bots, don't they? real fast until the last few there. They're trying to give me stone as they charge up there. Yeah, there's not going to be a whole lot more to say. One of the other things, if you're new to my channel or if you don't remember, is I said sometimes there would be times where there's not going to be a lot of commentary because there's not a lot to say. This is one of those times we're just moving items. Still deconstructing down there. No, they're done. So what are they doing? Charging? Yeah, I guess they're flying down there to charge up. Very close. One or maybe two more trips after this one.
That was fast. Happy to see our defense is holding up well so far. Okay, this should be the last trip. Okay, and all my bots look like they finally got charged up too. Oh no, here they are. They're still following me. Yeah, it's going to take them a while to charge up. So, okay, for next episode, let's extend the bus further. Let's get our iron gear wheels moved which means we have to move the mall over one block and we have to move the petroleum gas and the light oil. We'll do that the same way we just did the, the lubricant and the oil. And then that will let us move this over here and then move these down here. And then we can dismantle the rest of the base after that, I think. So yeah, that's the plan. So that's going to do it for this one. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.